Uh, okay, so... Back on topic. Um... Hydrate. Yeah, hydrate first, but... Um... Well, you'll need something that actually hydrates, not that crappy Pepsi stuff, you know. That's just full of garbage. So the colors are the eyes, right? I mean, that's what it seems like to me, but what do I know? Also, interestingly, why am I missing the blue eye on this, on the like, inventory screen? You haven't gotten it yet. You have to use your three magic spells to uh, unlock it. Yeah, I think that's probably just a graphical glitch. Sure. Some description. Of course it is. We can quite, quite, I think you can quite clearly see behind me, I've got all three of the freaking things here. One's a ghost. Not really there. The oh. I pity the. <laughs> I pity the fool! That says something, hero or a fool. The thing? Yeah. Why are the ellipses, why are the, why is the ellipses in, in the middle of the letters? Put it at the bottom. At the bottom? What do you mean? The the first word on the bottom line? No, the ellipses at the, at the end. Three dots. I don't know, it just means dot dot dot. Yeah, ellipses. It's an open-ended question. No. Ellipses are used to denote just an open-ended, like, here, read right between the lines. Or an open ended statement. So if it was an open ended question, it would still have a question mark after the ellipses. Okay. Um... So let's take stock of what we've done. We... We sang the song backwards, flipped uh, from within the screen, which gave us the website address. We went to the website, there was a video, there was an audio file, we found the symbols in the audio file, which read, we are the eyes of the far shore, which seems to allude that the eyes of the far shore are the three colors, red, green, blue. And they're the shape of the language. Each symbol was corresponded with a sequence of notes. Okay, I guess we gotta I guess we gotta listen to this again. Pay more attention. But first Man, you know all right. Just thought about That's, it. I can't believe it's almost October. Yeah, one more day of September, man. Crazy. 
Yeah, I was like, didn't we just start September? <laughs> yeah. That's what it feels like. Okay, oh, let me set this up again. Grayscale, all stories, 10,000, lots of frequencies, one zero padding. Okay, right. So let's listen to each symbol then, I guess. I can see the game and audacity. I mean, I need that. There you go. All right, so this is quite interesting. You can actually kind of like see the, on this spectrograph we got here, you can actually kind of see like the chords here as well as they're being played. So you kind of like got, it's kind of incrementing up. So it goes one, two, three, four, holds five, goes up five and six. So, what does that mean? Do we have to take these sounds and work out like what chords are playing? Are we going into like that much detail or am I just now massively overthinking? I mean, we, we is that first one. The second one is R. Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. Translate the up and down to the angles. So that's the case, jeez. Watched uh, you know, Mika talking about how fascinating this was. But, like the symbols being in the audio. Uh, the, I saw a video of a guy that played uh, the keyboard, and, and he had a screen up. I think it was, I think he was using MIDI. Basically, 
used to uh, what he was doing on the keyboard and it was showing up on the screen as he as he did each note and he went through and did a a, a portrait using sound it's like yeah his his face i was like that's freaking cool <laughs> Yeah, so I, I can see the six notes every time, and we can, I can quite easily, like, break them up. Where? Where I'm, like, potentially struggling. So this would be better to do in paint, because I can use the line tool. Keep things nice and straight. Oh, really? You're going to keep that there? Sure. Um, okay. So we got in a line than that. Jeez. A Rosetta Stone start, starter kit. <laughs> One, two, three. Or Looks like you're uh, <clears throat> doing a DNA DNA sequence. This one is two notes repeated each time. There's one there. That's what there. this is. It's actually DNA there. sequencing. One there. Two, three, four. Six. This one's actually got seven, interestingly. Seventh. Uh, no, it's six. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. What's this note here then? Six. Counting wrong. That's not. That's not a note. It it ends. It ends before that red line. Okay, if you say so. I mean, that's just what it looks like to me. It's like, yeah. Even the, even the sixth one on that one doesn't look like a complete note. Again, like here, it's almost like there's a... Like this blah on a six note. No, I'm just going to put a blue line there for now because... Garble. Maybe it's five notes on that last one and seven on the other one. That would that would be uh This one is interesting. Come back to that in a minute. Let's just do this last one here. There's some sustained notes in that penultimate one. So I'm not sure where there's a line there and a line there. Yeah, that's what I said, LB. Maybe it's and five on, the, on that one and seven on the other. But I don't know if, if that's the case on the variable. So it looks like some of those just aren't notes. They're too muddled up. Yeah, I, I mean, looking at this one, I can't see any way to break up these sustained notes. 
So I don't know. I mean, the only way to sort of like listen, like try and tell, I suppose, would be to actually listen to this one again. Seven. Was was the next yeah. one five? Uh, hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, so there was a seven. That was a seven. Okay. So is Probably that darn. is that next one a seven? This one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right. That one's a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, yeah I guess that's it's definitely fine. easier if you can hear it. <laughs> I would sort it out, but it's too much faff to kind of. Uh, I don't care. It's fine. Dick around with sound and keep changing uh, no, the source I, on. I, I'm not worried about it. I'm not. I'm not trying to get you to fix it. It's uh, yeah. I was, I was just saying. Uh, I was just going about visuals. Look right. It could have been, yeah, like it was seven. Then that one's definitely four, though. This one is definitely four. So that's interesting. So there's one seven, and then there's one four, and the rest are sixes. Maybe it's uh, eight, six, seven, five, three, or nine. Check the second one again. <laughs> yeah, no, okay, that's... Yeah, no, I think that's four. It's three, because it's got three sustained notes, hasn't it? I've just split it up into that, thinking I was having to split everything into six. Okay, yeah, so, yeah. I say this is pretty damn tricky. That's like six. Props to everyone who three, uh, figured this out. Seven. Well, this isn't a. Um, I don't think that's a six either. Which one's that? That's the fourth one. Yeah, I'll be. Yeah. Oh, it's a six. I, I it's can't a even six. imagine making the main game with the uh, the amount of puzzle, the deviousness of of the puzzles, much less going this deep. Yeah, they they went hardcore on this. Definitely a lot of forethought and time and energy. And you could tell they definitely spent a lot of time on the language. Uh, to me, it looks like, like they kind of just said, let's do another language. Kind of just started out with the, okay, we'll just use the hex shape. And then started with, okay, let's make 
consonants from the mostly from the outside and then vowels mostly from the inside or something along those lines and just kind of gradually created a an alphabet which is to me is pretty damn wild just to make a whole new language based on our our letters i mean english letters rather uh, i'm not gonna lie at this point i have no idea what i'm meant to be doing anymore well don't ask me because I, I can't help you on this <laughs> uh i would never have gotten this far Are we saying that there's like a another hidden language? Is that what we're saying? Please. Well, were you saying it'll be like imagine they're making an indie game with two hidden languages? Is there another? hidden language in this game yeah that's what i was thinking lb i mean like geez how much further can you really get I, personally i would have been more than satisfied with uh i mean it i had finished what you had done like two years ago the fairies speak to you? Wait. Um. Uh. Yum. Where was the entrance to the... Oh, is it down? I can never remember where anything is. It's down, isn't it? Wait, what game is this? Hey, what's that closet? Closet. Yeah, it looks like a closet. <laughs> Big ward rare from the top of the staircase. Wow. So wait, this this whole song can be translated into something. Is that is that what you're saying? Because if that's the case, that is just insane. Oh, it's not speaking. Hold on, so where was the so long since I used it? Should I turn the music down? What the uh, twenty soul was redeemed or whatever. It's just like telling me that I've got all the fairies. Oh, okay. Okay. 
So I suppose the only way to like check what the fairies say then would be to actually go back to the actual stream where I did it and kind of um all right well I think I think this is probably the part where I need to draw the line yeah it seems like a good spot because um, I think, if I'm honest, I think I've been kind of winging it for quite some time now, and I'm lucky I have managed to get to where I've got, I think. But genuinely, if it's down now to, like, translating music and things... <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, you know, I've spent enough time translating the symbols without having to translate the music. Yeah, I think that's just... Uh, an add-on, over-the-top, overkill thing for 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 All a right. very niche set of players. All right, so I'm gonna go into the. I, I don't know if this will tell me anything. All right, finally. Let's 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 start. Checking some stuff out. Um, yeah, Super Meat Boy it is. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> Where would it be? I don't know if it's included in this, perhaps. How many achievements That's... do you have? Out of uh, I'm, missing, many? I'm missing three. I'm going to have a uh, 36. Ah, oh, damn. Well done. You, uh, yeah, I've got 33 naturally. What are we missing? Let's have a look at the achievements first, then. Let's have a look. So I'm missing whoops. Let me make a note of these. Whoops. Um, too cute to smash. Oh, dear. That looks like... That looks like saving up some stuff. I maybe shouldn't have used those. Maybe you got to save so many of those money pot things without using them. And then bring it to the wrong fight. All right, let's have a look to see what uh, these actually are. Uh, how far would you have to go in to get those? I don't know. I mean, uh, all right, I'll have a look. I, I, will, I will do them. Don't get me wrong. If there's only three to do, um, I'm sure probably on a new game plus, it probably wouldn't take that long. Yeah, because we're not doing all this side puzzle stuff. All right, doesn't. How to get a gun before getting the stick or sword, whatever. Oh, is this the... Um, so, LB, is this what you mentioned before about the um, the door and the west gate? Like, you can get a sword... Like, earlier in the game? Is this what you meant? No? It's a pretty bad achievement guide. Let's look at a different one. Oh, this one looks a bit more. Um, right, what are we looking for? We are looking for... Bring it to the wrong fight. Obtaining the firearm before the sword. You'll have to navigate through a lot of areas with nothing but your stick. It can be aggravating and challenging. However, this is an achievement you can go for right away. So you can always start a new file if you don't want to go for this one right away. What? You yeah, can't wait. This I is think a, I know what they meant, but how this they is an achievement it. you can go for right <laughs> away. So you can always start a new game if you don't want to go for this one right away. <laughs> okay, it's saying that if you don't want to go for it right away and you play as usual then you can go back and just start a new game right okay and, and start it right away yeah all right so uh, so it we have to get the gun kind of funny the way it was 
Uh, Let's get the gun before that. So, two coots smash. Yeah, obtained by having ten money banks at once. Do not use or destroy any of them, or the achievement will be missed for that playthrough. Can additionally be obtained after completing completion of the game and beginning new game plus carrying over all your items. Then you'll only need to collect however many you're missing with a fully restocked map. Oh, well, I ain't got none, so I'm going to have to find ten. That uh, sucks. And where was the last one? Whoops. Obtained by freezing yourself. Drop an ice bomb at your feet to freeze yourself and obtain this achievement. Well, that should be an easy one. Seems like that would be accidentally done. Anyway. Oh, I think my controller is derped. Get your space bar. Well, I yeah, I, I, I had this issue before. It's like I'm now stuck in strafing mode for some reason. I can't remember how I got out of it before. It's like I'm locked on. Permanently locked on. Yeah, you go to options, uh, exit, exit strafing mode. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, you froze. You froze nothing. There you go. Nailed it. Achievement unlocked. Now you got two. Confetti cannon. Yeah, I think those are the two achievements. May take a bit of time. I mean, let me have a look at like the video for this. How long is this guy's video? Oh, of course, it's... Um... Yeah, you got to open it up. Okay, so, okay, so that's, about, that's about 13 minutes to do that. Um, which is fine. Well, it's maybe. fine, but... It, that depends on how much talking and BSing around he does. Just see, that, that might be me who made that video. It only takes 30 seconds. <laughs> you know what I mean, Vern? No, there's no talking. They're literally just going. Literally just going for it. Okay. Well, that seems... I mean, it seems pretty tough. I'll be honest. It doesn't seem... But in like 13... They get it in 13 minutes. Um, but they're like going to like Frog's Domain, doing all the Frog's Domain to get the grappling hook, then going to the quarry. Um, yeah, you got a 404 error on your. Uh, yeah, on my, on my coins. <laughs> all right so that's that one i mean the other one is the um um the other one is the do free watch the thingy my jiggies i think that's the technical name yeah give us the give us the layman's term for it <laughs> Um, the one to get all of the money things. I know that doesn't make much sense. I suppose that... How long was the video for that one? Copy video URL. Okay, that's 11 and a half minutes, but I'm guessing this literally just shows you the locations. So that one will probably take quite a bit of time. Um, well, that's fine. I mean, that's something I can chip away with kind of like on my own. 
off camera sort of thing. Yeah, meanwhile, uh, oh, it's, it's, need, I don't need know. to play uh, Super Meat Boy. I, did a, I just cashed in my coins for a stream takeover. You didn't. Don't lie to me. Yeah, I did. You totally, haven't got enough. No, I totally did, man. Just you haven't got me. enough. Just trust uh, okay, me. so, LB, is there anything else? <laughs> is there anything else that uh, you would like me to take a look at um, while we've still got a little bit of time left? Got an hour. Hour of Super Meat Boys, but everybody's looking forward to. Actually, probably what I should do is let's take a look at this spreadsheet you sent, actually. So this is the, yeah, geez. So let me get this straight. Like the whole, like that whole quest was basically just to point you in the right direction of like marrying up the symbols to the musical notes. So that you can then go and decode even more phrases based on the musical notes, right? That's insane. I mean, at least I was right about the chord progression, the, like the chords and things I saw. That's one thing. It's mad. Yeah, it's pretty nuts, I have to say. So this is this is still but what you're basically saying is this is still like an active thing that people are still looking into. Yeah, that's nuts. That's something that I don't think any AAA games have ever done that I'm at least that I'm aware of. But and again, I'm no aficionado of games. Yeah, AAA games would have incentives to do this, but they would charge you another thirty dollars for it. <laughs> yeah, for each each subsection. Want 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 the language? That's thirty dollars. Oh wait, we threw another language in. That's another thirty dollars. Thank you very much. Uh, sorry about all the bugs, and we figured it out, and it said you were wrong, but you were right. Our bad. All right, so the Seeker spell. Here's the patch. Only $5. Nope, no folds of local truth here. Fairy chest one. See you at the fall. Mountain door opens. Share your wisdom. Shop intro, we don't know. Shop loop, don't know. Strike a bell, ding dong. Website, which we, we got already. Purgatory. Yeah, it says Limbo. That's where I spend my life. Yep. New game is new. Title screen says Welcome, interestingly. Boy and Well says Yum. Yum. Seeker spell, no treasure. Nope, no folds of local truth here. Okay. Bomb spell. Phew. Uh, the extra save sure file. That. There's something you can do there. Okay, well, we'll go back to that in a minute. Ending screen, the end. Fairy chest. Woohoo! Woo ha ha! You found, uh, you found me, yay! What up, little fox? Troll chest in the east forest. Is that the chest that I haven't been able to open because I don't know how to get to it? There is one chest. I, that, I, I that one up on the ledge. No, it's not on the ledge. It's it's down below. I'll, I'll go to it in a minute. Open fairy chest in the waterfall cave. Oh, hey there. What a journey to over here. Ha, now I'm joking around. Really glad to be out of that cold, tiny chest and moving into this cold, damp cave. What an upgrade. Ha ha, I'm kidding. But seriously, if you see Andrew out there, 
the developer. Tell him to stop putting me in that box. Ha, I'm kidding. No, really, a good kid. Good luck with the air, or should I say to the as should I say as the air? Whoa, spoilers. Look out. Ha. But no, I mean it. Uh, forge your own path, golden or otherwise. Either way, I'm back in the box, right? Ha ha ha. <laughs> yeah, I'll be. That sounds like some stupid shit I would do just to kill myself. All right, let's. Um, okay, so first things first. Then let's go to extra extra save file shenanigans, which is this one. Firebomb spell. Okay. So that is, do I need to, I might need to look at the manual on the other one first, or have I got that page? Is that the Jalapeno? No, it's this one. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was going to say is it the uh, candy cane one, but barbershop bomb. Okay. Uh, I should probably draw the path on here just to be doubly sure. Uh, there, 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 there. Not that it's difficult, but. Yeah, just. Up yeah, that's right kind of what I did right with the. Um, kind of what I did with the ice bomb in the end, there'll be actually. Okay. So let me clear out these and then let's do the spell. And then, okay. That's a lot of health uh, to have to deplete. Yeah, definitely. Although, at least it's not hard. <laughs> it's not like you're doing anything tricky here. <laughs> Stop it's staying still, as long as you can manage to stay still. Yeah, that's, uh, that, that's the tricky part, man. <laughs> gotta got got get moving. I know. Right, like, right now is when I would move just to fuck with it, and then I'd be like, God damn it. You know. Coins everywhere. Where are we at? Wait, is this like, I'm, I'm going to go out on a limb here and say, is this like an early prototype of the map? Look at the trees and stuff. It, yeah, it, it looks, that's why I, th I thought it, it looks very similar to the. Yeah. And it's blocky and Minecrafty. Yeah, it's not as polished. Yeah, it's yeah. L LB said it's a uh, like a dev test world. That's mad. That is cool. Yeah, instead of grass, yet you have trees. Yeah, there's grab on things. Canning forks. Whoa. Whoa. That's a huge blob. Huge blob just went bye bye. Yeah. Hmm. 
Maybe yeah, I this um this looks more old school now. Wow, the color on the waterfall as you walk into it it turns blue as you go up and the blue goes away as you go down. I'm wondering like with the Yeah. I'm wondering if like with the blob as such whether or not if you chase it around it does something. Blobbling in Mr. Pop Dabalina. Yum. Alright, looks like it's big, not gonna move. Big fat pink sperm. Looks like it doesn't sperm move any whale. further than that though. That looks different. I guess, yeah, I guess this is the place, the original, like, altar place where before um, they um, built, like, the big shrine and everything, this is where, like, the colors would come. Ah, this is nuts. Yeah, you also got a... Uh... Instead of just flowers, you also have the greenery. Well, this is a different enemy. These enemies kind of like don't feature in the main. <laughs> it's like you're sliding them around like colorful recolor again. Yeah, that instant disappearing act. Yeah, they're just sort of like placeholder kind of enemies, yeah. which is mad. Oh, wow, this looks very, like, mazy. Oh, what are you? Are you like a... I thought that was maybe like... A... This is like the shieldy spider thingy. Yeah, I... I... I thought it was maybe like an early version of the um the octopus thing. Oh, I think no, actually they kind of look a bit more like the things we fought underneath the quarry area. I might be wrong, that, but that that bridge looks like it's like you're playing inside the editor. Yeah. Dev tech, like dev textures with collision boxes and things. I guess there's just like loads of different stuff to explore here. Um, I'm guessing like there isn't really anything, anything like super secret here. Might be wrong, but. Have a quick check of the text before we um, move on to the next real quick. Can we chop those little trees down. Uh, okay, so the text says um, T. Try, try your, try your best, Daniel Song. Try him. T R. I as in guy. Oh, try your. Hmm. Try him. Try him. Try 
try um Uh, oh. Uh. All right. All right. Try him for eight. I I don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't know what the uh, individual ones mean, but that was like the big long thing. At the bottom. Triumvirate is a word. What's that mean? Well, that's a word I haven't heard of. Well, I search the word and Google gives me a picture of um, the tangerine man himself. <laughs> that or a triarchy is a political institution ruled or dominated by three individuals known as tri triumvirs the arrangement can be formal or informal the three leaders in a triumvirate are notionally equal the actual distributor of power may vary okay Okay, well, that kind of makes sense then, I guess, because there's obviously three colors and there's three different things to kind of. Um, yeah, and they, and they all kind of usurped together. All right, let me go then to. I just want to go quickly back to the forest. And. I guess that I'll show you where I think the troll chest is because I don't know how to get to it. This one in particular has like bugged me for a while. But it's the only one off the top of my head I think that I can really think of that I haven't got. There's probably like a secret door or something that I'm missing. This one here, LB. the top right where the spider came from. Right here, right? Do you know your left from your right? I'm on the right of the bridge. Unless. Ah, there we go. Hey, isn't the coins? Coin number 17. We found all the coins. Uh, Murdercon. Uh, but yeah, off the top of my head, I don't think there is um, any other ones. 
spring to mind. I'm sure I haven't even scratched the surface with the um, secrets. Um, but yeah, 